Hi guys, it's Steve from Steve Small World. Um, just a quick vid this week. I'm just doing some ice shards for scattered terrain. Nice, cheap, quick build. Um, if you've been on the Facebook page, you see I've been a bit busy with the main build for the show. Um, so that's where the time's gone. Right, before we get cracking, let's have a quick look at what we need. Just to prove terrain can be dirt cheap. Some vinyl floor tiles, four for a quid. And all I've done with that is cut two discs out of it, size of two piece. Tons left, but he touched it. And we have a bird or anything. Plastic cutlery. Actually, this one the forks. Whole lot. Brilliant. And we need some acetone, which I've hidden over here. It's just nail polish remover. That's actually the expensive way to buy it. You can just buy acetone. I like looking at the DIY store. Um, a blue wash. PVA. Always need PVA. Snowflock, we can use baking soda, etc. There's ways around that. And just a bit of white paint. Right, we'll get to the table and crack on. Right guys, I cut a piece of vinyl floor tile into that size of a 2P. Stuck a piece of fabric on the bottom and just cut around it. I could have just shoved a bit of paper on. So just peel the adhesive back off, stick it on so it just so it doesn't stick to everything. That's all that's for. Wipe that down. And I've got to put the hot glue gun up, so I'll set that go in a minute. While that warms up, we'll have a look at what else we got. So we've got our cheap plastic forks. A stack of these for a quid, as I said. And we just snap the prongs. Different lengths. There's a little bit there. You can even use the body of the fork itself. A bit careful doing this. Uh, I don't want that one. Let's just cut some bits. We're going to add a layer onto the base here because it's very shiny at the moment. It's a bit too smooth, so we just smear some glue into it to get some texture on it. Extra to that, and we we'll start building it up around the middle of our base, and we want a nice lot on it in the middle. Don't know that one. She's one of these. So get some hot glue in there, just shove it in, kind of up it a little bit. Do a little bit. Right. Put that in there. Just got a tiny shower here. Don't want to waste it. Shove that one in there. Get the hot glue gun out. Any wisps you can pick up the end of the glue and just put it that way. Smear it down if you need to. Alright, let's get another one. Precision going on here. Until you can get some nail acrylic and picking it up later on. But I'm going to do it this way because I forgot to buy any. So I'm just going to grab a bit of hot glue from the bottoms. Picking up around the base of these a little bit. Right, that's all set. I'm going to quick rub over my fingers, take off any loose wisps. Right, then we're going to grab some acetone. It's 
nail polish remover, but it's a high acetone one. This stuff stinks. Everyone complains about it when I use it. The thing is, I'm actually pretty well immune to the smell of it after working with it for donkey's years. So all you do is coat it from the tips down. Let it run. That will frost them up. Okay, that evaporate off. That's that. I'll probably do. Let's bring this up so you can see it. Oh, there we go. Let's grab some blue wash. This might be a little bit too blue, so just drop a drop of water in the lid. Do it that way. Just bring it down. Let it run. Go to the middle. There we go. And we'll just let that dry off. So it might show up a few other wisps when you do it, so you just pull them off. using a bit that's left on the board and I haven't actually got enough for it, I don't think. Right, we'll let that dry a sec. Right, there you have it. Very quick, easy build. Anyone can do it. Go off, give it a go. Warning with us saying yes it does stink, have the windows open, etc. Well ventilated. Said I worked with the stuff for like donkey's years um, in a previous department I used to work in. So I'm sort of semi-immune to it while everyone around me is running around going, Aah. I'm like, what the <laughs> explains what I'm like I am. Um <laughs> it's the fumes. Right, I'm gonna be a bit cracking on. I don't know if I'm gonna get a video up this week, another video up. I'll see how things go. I've got a bit of airbrushing to do, might do a bit on that, and basically get a few bits finished up for Legionary on the 13th of May. So if you're about down in the southwest, please look at the website, um, the Legionary website, Legionary 2017, that's what you need to look up, it's easy enough to find. It's down at the Marsh Barton Livestock Centre, it be a great day, be good to catch up with a few people, come over, say hello. Adam from World of 28mm is over there as well, so there's a couple of us terrain guys down there, so please come over and have a chat. Um, hope to see a few of you there. Please like, subscribe, share, let's get it out there. And we'll keep cracking on with these videos and hopefully everyone will be building terrain. Right, see you soon. Take care. Cheers.